Hey y'all, this is Parisian's Intuition Tarot. Um, I would like to start with a moon message for y'all. For my Pisces. I have a moon message for my Pisces. Alright. The card that came out is... It says, I am honest with myself and um, others. Okay. Oh, and somebody might be watching y'all. Y'all see that eye? All right. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Divine spirits and love and light. Ancestors, loved ones, Father God. Can I please have a card for my Pisces? All right. So, y'all got two cards. We got the mirror here. All right. Some of y'all may be doing some self-reflection right now, thinking about past events that have happened and learning from your experiences. We also have Amrara. It says, Wonder Voyage, Crossing Deep Waters, Pilgrimage, Journey of the Soul. So some of y'all may be going through um, the dark night of the soul, okay, as well. Doing some shadow work, you know, trying to heal. Uh, let's see. What am I going to next? Let's go to some tarot. Let's get some tarot. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? The first card that came out is the High Priestess, okay? Listen to your intuition, okay? Please have a few cards for my High Priestess. All right. We got the Five of Cups here, okay? Some of y'all may have lost someone, all right? And you're thinking back on everything that has happened, what you've lost, um, regret, guilt, sadness. That's what that card is about. Or someone is feeling this way towards you. Missing you. Then we also have the Knight of Cups here. The Knight of Cups is about an emotional love offer coming towards you. Alright. And then we got the Three of Wands here. So you may be at a distance of this person. This person may be um, at a distance from you. But um, you may be waiting for this offer. It's definitely coming. Alright. And then we got the Seven of Pentacles um, here, which is about waiting for things to come into fruition. So we have two cards of waiting here. So you're going to have to be patient. You're going to get what you want. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Divine Spirits, another night. Please have a few cards for my Pisces. Oh, that was a lot, y'all. That was a lot. All right. So we got snooping here. Somebody's snooping. It says, what will she or he do next? Someone is in your business. So someone is definitely snooping. This could be you or your person. We also have longing here. Okay. Someone is definitely longing for you. All right. And you may be longing for them as well. Um, usually when I get the mirror card right here, this is like a twin flame energy to me. Okay. So you may be dealing with your twin flame. Okay. Either way, know that this person is a divine counterpart. We also have empath here, okay? So you may be feeling other people's feelings. You may be feeling your lover's feelings, okay? Um, be careful with being an empath, though, because it says you're feeling other people's energies intensely, and it can take a toll on your emotional well-being, all right? So if you feel a certain way, like really, really sad, and you don't know where it's coming from out the blue, that might be other someone else's um, feelings that you're feeling, okay? This could be your kinfolk, your man, um anybody you know what i'm saying but you're you're an empath so you're feeling their feelings and then we have family here okay so this person may be a part of your family or it could be your baby dad or your husband or whatever all right put them out the way let's get you some more messages here can i please have a few cards for my pisces the first card that came out it says honor and respect will come to you all right so you are real respected then we also have peace and harmony here. So you will get some type of peace and harmony here after some type of conflict or some type of sadness or pain that you've been through. Get another call up for my Pisces. Career. So some of y'all may be focused on your career right now, okay? But you got to be careful though because there are some type of forces working against you, right? Let me get three more for y'all. Can I please have a few more cards for my Pisces? All right, we got rabbit. It says too much concern with sexual matters. So some some of y'all may be sexually frustrated, or your person is sexually frustrated. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Divine spirits, 
can I please have free card? Oh, that's what it says. A sincere wish will be granted. All right. So whatever you're wishing for or manifesting will be granted, but you just got to be patient. Okay, and they want you to control your anger. You will be sorry, so control your anger. Because you might be frustrated right now, waiting for so long. You don't want to. And it says, muddled, unclear thinking. So you may have some unclear un um, thinking going on. But they want you to also pay attention to your work, all right? All right, move some of this stuff out the way. Let's see. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? All right. So we got Prince Charming here. Beware of how charming, though. So somebody is coming towards you who is very charming, but be careful with him, though. We also have Tree of Life, Unity, Strength, and Connections. All right. So this person may be a part of your family here. All right. And then we also have Soul Searching. Like I was saying, some of y'all might have went through the... um dark night of the soul okay doing some soul searching yeah some of y'all might have went hermit mode you know but you're gaining guidance here though it says inner guidance self-reflection all right so self-reflection here we got some self-reflection going on here all right but you will be unlocking secrets through all of this okay we'll go ahead and go to my decks Okay, my deck is called The Hidden Secrets by me. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces? Divine Spirits and Love and Light. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces? Divine Spirits and Love and Light. All right, so the first card we got is, it says the mom, dad, sister, brother, cousin, and them are watching you gossiping, okay? So, you know, the family members of your person or your family members or something, all them gossiping and the family is all up in it, all up in y'all business, y'all situation. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Being messy. Then we got somebody suffering in silence without you and missing you. Okay, so this person is suffering in silence, missing you. And then we have using someone for money and clout. All right, so someone's using someone for money and clout. We also have secretly possessive and aggressive over you, but they're trying to hold back their jealousy. Okay, they're probably trying to act like you know ain't nothing wrong, they ain't tripping, but really they are. Okay. <clears throat> And then this person may be in a relationship but missing you and wanting to be with you. It says already in a relationship but wants to be with you. Wishing. Okay. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Divine Spirits and Love and Light. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Divine Spirits and Love and Light. Okay, we got admiration. Okay, so this person admires you. It says you're brave, you're honest, you speak your truth, and that's why I admire you. So they admire you very much so. And then we also have rock bottom, okay? It says no car, no job, no love, no place. So this person is a bit broken. They hit rock bottom. That's why someone might may be using someone for some type of money as well, okay? And they also feel like you're adorable. It says you are adorable and deserve to be spoiled at the bottom of the deck, okay? Can I please have a few more cards for my Pisces? All right. But see, they like them groupie females, okay? Them groupies. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? And then, but they want to see you face to face, all right? It says, I need to see you face to face missing you. So, like I was saying, this person may be at a distance from you or you're just not seeing them right now, okay? Because see how they're waiting for the ships to come in? Looking towards the ships and stuff, waiting for them to come? Well, you just may not be seeing them right now. Maybe taking a break, okay? Maybe they at work, all right? But um, they also feel like you're a warrior goddess. It says um, they can't figure you out. It says you're beautiful, mysterious, and bold, which is making you very intimidating to others. Okay, so you come off a bit intimidating because you're a strong, beautiful woman. All right? Strong, beautiful, confident woman. Okay, what do I want to go to next? I go to these. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces, Divine Spirits, and Love and Light, Ancestors, Loved Ones, Father God? Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces, Divine Spirits, and Love and Light? Oh, all right. Someone needs some help, all right? They definitely need some help. 
Let's see. Because somebody is suffering in silence and then someone needs some type of money. Okay. Can I please? Oh, and then they rock bottom. He go rock bottom right here. Somebody hit rock bottom. They feeling broken, sad, low. Okay. That's And they need that help. Can I please have a few cards for my Pisces? Okay. So the card that came out, it says, he got a girl and you got a man. All right. So this is a foursome. So we seen that earlier that somebody's in a relationship with somebody. We wanting to be with somebody else. So he got a girl. You got a man. All right. We also got here, be careful with him. That's one of the first cards that we seen, remember? Because we seen that Prince Charming card, but they said, um, what the card say, y'all? Beware of how charming. That's what it said. All right. And then the other card they said was, um, I'm in love with you only. Okay. I'm in love with you only. But it looks like this person is still in a relationship with someone. So be careful with that. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces? Alright. So, someone's keeping a low profile. Okay? This could be you keeping that low profile because it looks like you're doing a lot of self-reflection. Um, and some of y'all went um, on a dark night of the soul. Uh, usually, when you do that, you detach from others and withdraw from others so you can hear yourself. You know what I'm saying? What's going on with you inside, you know, instead of listening to other people around you. We also have, can we have a poly relationship? So, they want to have a poly relationship because they want you and they want her too, okay? That's what's going on there. And somebody's thinking about past events like we were saying earlier, self-reflection, okay? Thinking about it. Thinking back on the past. All right. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces? All right. So someone is posting about you. It says, I post about you on social media. Okay? Post about you on social media. Anything else from the Pisces about it here? Okay, some of y'all got some health concerns that y'all need to deal with. Um, with these health concerns, this could be mental, physical, or spiritual. All right? So pay attention to it. We also have childhood trauma, which goes back to that past stuff, past events. Okay? You could have known this person from your childhood as well. All right? Some of y'all. And then we also have non-stop excellence. Okay? So keep focusing on your work, your career. Okay? And pay attention to your work. For some of y'all, y'all may be bisexual, okay? Or y'all person is bisexual. Can I please have a few cards from my Pisces. All right. Romance is on the way, okay? The love that you seek is on the way. But we've seen that, though, because that Nine of Cups is on his horse on the way. All right? And Cups is emotions. Love, feelings. We also have making up assumptions about you. So someone here is making up assumptions, all right? Making up assumptions. Then we also have sexy icon or a, a sex symbol. So, y'all may be very sexy, okay? And someone is very sexually frustrated, okay? Remember, y'all got that card? So, somebody may be fiending for you right now, okay? And their person may know about you because at the bottom of the deck, it says, a karmic wants to speak to divine feminine, Okay? Anything else? Okay. So we also have the kids are telling what's going on at home. So your kids maybe telling what's what grandparents or, or your baby daddy or something, what you got going on at home. Maybe baby daddy is concerned about um who you dating, all right? Or baby mama is concerned about who you dating. Okay. But something that's all a cover up, somebody trying to cover up something. And then we also have here someone is trying to steal your work or take credit for it. Okay. So somebody may be trying to take your ideas or something that you're doing, your projects or something like that. Be careful. Okay. But you definitely have a heartfelt message coming in. Let's get y'all some advice. Can I please have some advice for my Pisces? Can I please have some advice for my Pisces? We have dedication. Okay, so be very dedicated. It says stay dedicated to your goals, efforts that will reap your success. Okay, so you will have success. Just stay focused and stay dedicated. And you definitely got that love message coming in. All right, you definitely manifested that. 
before I even said manifest it here, manifestation is at the bottom of the deck. Law of attraction, thoughts become things, okay? All right, so continue to have positive thoughts. Um, this is all for the Pisces reading. Thank you.